everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with the bonus love read. This reading is going to be for the sign of Pisces. So, fishies, let's see what are their feelings and messages for you. I will be taking message cards from them as well, and uh, um, we will also be adding um, oracle cards in this reading as well. So, stay tuned. And uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you it is a general read, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that resonate and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. Let's see. Fishies, whoever it is that you're dealing with and you want to know their feelings, let's tap into their feelings for you and then we will be taking messages. So whoever it is, let's see. What is it that they feel for you right now? The Strength. Knight of Wands. <clears throat> Five of Cups. I feel like, you know, whoever it is that you're dealing with, this person uh, really needs your support right now. They really seek support, uh, strength from you right now, from this connection that they have with you. There is something that they are very upset with. There is something, maybe you are not aware of it. Maybe they are not revealing what is it that is hurting them right now. But I feel like, you know, this person really wants you to be understanding and available to them right now emotionally because they need your emotional support. Something has uh, happened, which is definitely bothering your person right now. Um... When it comes to, you know, how they feel about you, I feel like, you know, you are that one person who who knows them so well. And I feel like, you know, this person really knows that. Uh, but they will always kind of, you know, um, tell you that you don't know them. You don't you don't understand them. So that's them. I feel like, you know, this person is somebody who's very... Um, very sensitive but at the same time you you would always see a different side of them because they they are finding it very hard to be um uh you know expressive um you know majority of times like you know i, I don't see a person is somebody who's very expressive maybe you are somebody who's always expressive who's always like you know letting your heart out to this person but they are always like you know keeping it to themselves you will have to basically see what is this person feeling what are they you know really uh, thinking so I feel like you know, this person is somebody who, who who is not expressive at all about anything but for one thing. When, when it comes to their sexual desires, when it comes to their sexuality, when it comes to their uh, passion, when it comes to the fiery energy, I feel like you know, they are only expressive there only. Um, when it comes to emotions, they, they could be very um, sensitive uh, and uh, they, they have this uh, fear of... Uh, uh, getting too attached maybe because I feel like you know this person will like to always have a side uh, you know visible uh, to others where where they are fun where they are uh, you know open to uh, you know open to have open relationship uh, not that they want to have another person in another relationship it's just that they want it to be open because they don't want to have that you know sense of commitment uh, or sense of belonging um, revealed to the other person because they don't want to get vulnerable to get hurt so that's them i feel like you know they are very uh, very protective of their feelings but yes i feel like you know this person has a strong um emotional uh, expectation from you right now they really want you to be there uh, for them even though they are not talking to you even they are not you know giving you enough time but they want you to be there um you know at their back you really uh, you know this person really feels like um they want you there in their life and uh, that's they are expecting from you let's see more cards what else do they feel for you right now king of pentacles and king of souls i feel like you know for majority of you your person right now is not um at all giving into the connection right now to you uh all they want is to to know for themselves that yes you are there for them uh, you are not moving on. You are not leaving them. That's what they want from you right now. They are more focused on whatever that they are doing, and they need your support there. That's it. Like you know, that's how they are feeling for you right now. They they expecting that for you, uh, from you right now. Let's see what is the message from your person. What is it that they want you to know? What is it that they want you to know? Your person is right uh, now being very self centered is what I'm picking up. So, uh, yeah, you got to understand their uh their attitude right now. Um. If, if they are not uh, committed to you, doesn't mean that they are dating someone else. They are not. They are so occupied with something that they are working uh, towards. Uh, let's see what are their messages for you. The grass was not greener on the other side. I feel like, you know, this person is not happy with the way things are right now. They are not happy if, if they are invested in something else right now, which could be very well their career path. Um, they, they, they thought that uh, it's going to be easy for them not to think about you and then continue doing what they are doing. But it wasn't easy. And I feel like you know, this person really wants you to know that. 
um, I love you, but I love my family too. For some of you, your person could be very busy and occupied with their work and their family as well, which could be the reason why they are unable to give you time. Let's see one card underneath the deck. We do have the three of cups. Um, this person really feels very happy when they are with you. Uh, but then uh, I feel like, you know, um, this person is all yours. You've got to understand that. You know, even though they are always like, you know, occupied with so much happening, they're always conflicted with the with the what to give their time, family, work, you. But deep down, you've got to believe in one thing that this person is all yours this person is not a player this person is not going to play with your emotions feelings and anything to do with that i feel like you know this person maybe they are not committing to you it doesn't mean that they are not committed to you um you know they don't believe in having it said or having it uh you know um you know making it official or something like that this person really believes in the way they feel here and the way you feel here i feel like you know this person goes with that more than you know than than words so this person could be very unexpressive this could be somebody who's very uh much in, a, in an authority place of uh you know work as well i feel like you know this person is uh somebody who doesn't want to hurt anyone but they do uh you know kind of run away from the fact that they do hurt people with their attitude and i feel like you know this person is somebody who finds it very hard to maintain a healthy balance between work family love this person is really somebody who's extremist and in whatever they do they indulge themselves into that one thing be that you your family uh, their family their work they they give their hundred person to that one thing with what what they are doing so i feel like you know your person is more of a you know wh wherever they are they indulge in that if they are with family, they will be theirs only. Like, you know, they will not be using their phone. If they are at work, they will be doing that only. If they are with you, they, they will be doing you only. So that's how they are. Let's see more message. I try finding you in everywhere, everyone I meet. I feel like, you know, this person could have been having a lot of meetups with the, with different people. Uh, and every time they see someone else, they, uh, you know, uh, it's, it's more like, you know, they, they try to see how different you are from others. And they, they really want... Uh, the kind of person that you are to be um, with them and I feel like you know maybe right now you have detached or separated from your person they're really trying to find um, you in everywhere there because I feel like you know they find it very hard they might have thought that you know if you moved on from them and if you're checking this read from an for an ex maybe you they thought that you know ending a connection with you wouldn't be hard for them because they will you know be able to move on but somehow they are finding it very hard to move on because deep down they are so connected to you they feel all uh you know this they feel that they are all you know yours and that that feeling is not going away they you know whenever they try to move on they try um you know looking for you in everywhere so this person is definitely not you know detached emotionally from you for sure uh they have been having you on their mind lately let's see more cards here let's uh, let's see more messages from your person okay we do have two cards uh i don't imagine my life without you so now they don't imagine their life without you i love you more than you love me i just don't express so that's what they want you to know uh they really love you just that they don't express it to you um let's see the oracle guidance let's see the uh, let's see what the oracle has to suggest for you for this uh situation that you are having with your person let's see i am helping your spiritual side to awaken fully so you can clearly see heavenly love I feel like you, know, you got to understand this one thing that God has been very kind to you and your person and this connection and I feel like you know the God has been uh you know making the two of you understand what the spiritual love uh, love looks like and the heavenly love looks like I feel like you know you both can feel sense that the bond that the love that you have for each other is something divine and I feel like you know that is exactly the reason why you are not together as of now because you had to learn that your person had to learn that and then only you will come back together because you and them are meant to be together just that maybe you are in a twin flame journey with your person right now so that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read if it helped you to like and subscribe till i do the next read for you guys take care and bye